History of Apple in 60 seconds. Two college dropouts, Steve Jobs and Steve Wozniak, wanted to make user-friendly computers in the 70s. Their first computer wasn't a big success, but Apple II revolutionized the computer industry with its first ever color graphics. Wozniak left Apple in 1983, and Jobs hired PepsiCo's John Scully as president. That didn't work out well, and Steve Jobs got fired from his own company in 1985 and went on to build another computer company, Next. In 1997, when Apple desperately needed a new operating system, they bought out Next, Steve Jobs' new company, and hired him back as an interim CEO. Steve Jobs made some big changes around Apple. Together with a young and promising product designer called Johnny Ive, Jobs developed the first iMacs and iBooks, followed by the iPod. In 2007, Apple introduced the iPhone, which over time became one of the most successful products ever. Steve Jobs died in 2011, leaving Tim Cook as the new CEO. Apple continued introducing new products and services from smartwatches to credit cards, speakers to streaming platforms. This was